Hello friends, today I am going to show you how to generate the script to take the user databases, multiple databases into offline. Select the instance new query. In order to take the single database into offline, uh, we have simple T SQL command alter database. Any database there name that you can to DBA uh, set offline. So if any database that is um, if any users got connected and if you want to do that database immediately you can use this uh, with rollback immediately command. So that what are the data users that are connected that, got, that are all got disconnected and immediately the, this database is will set into offline. So right now this is sample database so that's it. See if so immediately the database went to offline. So now in order to generate the script first we need to use how, let's see how many databases that I have in, in the instance select star forms is that sys databases. If you see here master temp db model msdb and D, uh, msdb are these from one to four are system databases and seven to one distribution is a replication is configured and the, this is the reason okay distribution database is also a system database so we you cannot take this databases into offline so we need to generate the script so what i need i'm going to do here i'm using alter database some space okay after that the symbol name after that uh, inverted comma some space set offline period immediate key space okay now this is the command now I don't want to uh, generate the script for the system database so where name is equal to all these columns these name and these names are in the part of this is databases where name is equal to or where name not in master model msdb okay mdb comma distribution the bracket and place all these into inverted commas Single inverted comma. Okay, now execute this command. Click execute. See all these command. Now select all. Go to new query. And paste it here and click execute. Okay, so uh, let's see this. All the user databases went, went into offline. So I will give give the uh, I will give the script in the description box for you handy, so you can do test in your session environment and uh, you can continue with the production as well i if you like this view thumbs up thank you have a nice day